Hi there, Brian Wright, Managing Partner of Wright Chat. Thanks for visiting our Six Figure Challenge page. What this page talks about and what we're gonna do um, is we are going to do a mystery call to your practice. And we are gonna break that mystery call down um, and showcase all the different ways you are losing hundreds of thousands of dollars in your career because of how that new patient phone call goes. All right, this is a free, so it's no, no obligation. You don't have to sign up with us or anything, but we are gonna do this analysis. We're gonna coach it for you. And you can give that, you can keep that coaching analysis. You can, you can use it to give to your receptionist uh, to help her uh, or him uh, implement some of these skill sets that we so heavily teach our call concierge that answer new patient calls on behalf of your practice. Uh, the other part of this six-figure challenge is, is all the different ways beyond how your receptionist is handling phone calls uh, that goes into it. It's phone calls that are being missed, that new patient calls that, that call your practice um, and your receptionists are too busy checking people out that are already on the phone. Um, you're losing hundreds of thousands of dollars in your career uh, with new patient calls being missed. The other ones are no-shows. How many new patient no-shows do you have? Is it a 5% rate, 20% rate? If you don't know, that is a number you absolutely should know uh, because that number causes hundreds of thousands of dollars of lost opportunities in a career. And it adds up quick, especially depending on what your average treatment fee is at your practice and your average case acceptance. If you start saying, hey, look, we're losing two new patients a month because of no-shows, 24 a year, 240 over a decade, I mean, you're talking millions upon millions of dollars that practices lose. Um, in addition, the six-figure headache, one of the biggest things, the biggest hurdles for a small business is you spend all this time training your people, whether it's clinically or the non-clinical positions, you know how it is. You know, Betty, you hire her, you think she's great, she gets pregnant, or she doesn't turn out to be great, you have to get rid of her, whatever it may be, and it's just an ongoing spinning cycle. And we all know it's not exactly easy to find employees as it goes right now either. Um, so another thing too is how much money are you losing by spending time training, retraining, et cetera? And do you have the expertise um, as a business owner to be training on the non-clinical skill sets that exist in your practice? The receptionist is a sales position. It's a customer service, marketing, psychology position, verbiage presentation present, uh, uh, position in your practice. It's where we come in and this whole world of missed calls, calls that aren't answered but aren't, aren't handled properly, objections that aren't handled properly, um, you know, no-shows. All of this relates back to the receptionists in this new economy. It's what Right Chat is so invaluable for on why we, we grow practices the rate we do, why we have a 99% client retention rate because once people come aboard, they don't leave. Uh, their life becomes on easy street and their business grows unlike ever before. So what this is gonna do when you sign up for it, we're gonna handle that mystery call. Uh, we're gonna do some analysis on that, uh, but also have you, again, change that mindset on the six figures you are losing uh, because of all those things I mentioned. Okay, look forward to helping your practice. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.